Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, you will learn how to retrieve questions from Blackboard and how to create study games with StudyMe. Let's first start with how to retrieve questions from Blackboard. With Respondus open, click the Retrieval and Reports tab. This is the fourth tab. Now, click Retrieve Questions. The Retrieve Questions wizard will launch. Follow the step-by-step -step instructions. First, we're going to choose an existing server or add a new server. Select the drop-down arrow next to Blackboard Server. Click Add New Server. Make sure Yes Check for Preconfigured Server Settings is selected. Now click Next. Enter a name to describe the Blackboard Server such as your name. Now you want to enter your login information for Blackboard. This is the information you use to log into Blackboard. Now enter your password. Click the Save My Username and Password on this computer only if this is not a public computer. Make sure the Run Connection Test under Respondus can run a connection test using the above settings to make sure it can uh, communicate with your online course. Click Next. The connection test will take some time. Once you see Retrieve Course List Complete, you can now click Next then finish. The pre-configured server settings wizard will close. Now you are back at the retrieve questions wizard. Choose an existing server, select the drop down arrow. Select the name you gave to describe your course. Click next. Choose a course to retrieve from. Select an exam or a pool. In this course, it happens to be a pool, but in yours, it could be an exam. Select the exam you would like. Now enter the name for the new file. We suggest the course name and the chapter in which the test is from. Now hit next. The file is now saved. Click OK. And click finish. The retrieve question wizard has now closed. To view your questions, click Preview and Publish, and you want to click Preview the file. View all questions by clicking the Next button. If you need to modify an item, click Modify Item. Modify the item and make sure you save the changes. It'll go back to Preview. When you're done, hit Close, and you can now close Respondus. And that is the end of this portion. Now we will learn how to create study games with StudyMate. With StudyMate open, you want to click the Import Wizard. The StudyMate Import Wizard will launch. First, you want to select what file format you will import. We are importing Respondus files. Now, click Next. Let's follow the step-by-step -step StudyMate import wizard. First, we're going to select the file to import. Click Browse. Navigate to your documents, Respondus Projects, and then click the file that you created. Now click the Respondus file and click Open. Choose where to add the questions. We're going to create a new file. 
we're going to name it. We are going to name it with the course name and the chapter number. Next, we're going to use the preview button to check for problems. Click preview. Click OK. And then click OK again. Now that we've previewed it, we can finish. Use the Preview and Publish tab to preview your quiz for any errors. Click to preview the file. View all questions by clicking the Next button. If you need to edit an item, click Edit this item. Edit the item and save the changes. To finish previewing, you will need to go back to Preview. If you are done previewing, click OK. Now click Publish. Click on the Publish Wizard. The Study Me Publish Wizard pop-up window will appear. Make sure Quiz and Challenge is checked and click Next. We are going to publish only to Study Me. Make sure that's selected and click Next. Now we will select or create a studymate.com account. We're going to click the downward arrow and click create a new account or register an existing one. If you do not have a studymate account, you need to select create a new studymate.com account, read the terms of service, and click that you have read them. Click OK. Follow the on-screen instructions and then click OK. Now back at the study may publish wizard once again click the downward arrow if you already have an account create a new account or register an existing one select add an existing studymate.com account to the list and click ok to add an existing studymate.com account to the list you will need to enter the username the user email and password that you use for your studymate.com account if you have, if don't remember your password, you can always click Forgot Password and then click OK. Now that you have registered or chosen your existing account, you want to click the drop down arrow in the StudyMate Publish Wizard once more. Select your StudyMate.com account and click Next. Enter the project name and description for use with StudyMate.com. We are going to use the course name. and the chapter number. The project name and the title can be the same, so you can copy and paste that. For the description, we will use please use the quiz and challenge to study for your quiz and final exam. Now we'll hit next. Now your project will be published to StudyMate. When it's ready, you will find a URL. Select this URL and copy it. Open Word or Notepad is fine and paste the URL. This URL can now be placed in your Blackboard course. This concludes the tutorial on how to retrieve questions from Blackboard and how to create study games with StudyMate.